Hey guys, so um, I have a mini haul for you and um, it's kind of collective but um, the main thing that I'm like very excited about is something from the MAC in the Groove collection and I'm gonna just start with that one. Um, and actually my mom bought this for me because she was, she was so nice. And um, it's my first mineralized skin finish in Stereo Rose. And um, it's a really pretty, like, um, it's like light pink, kind of sp not sparkly, like shimmery. And, um, let's see it there. And, um, Watch that for me. And there were some very pretty um, mineralized skin finishes, but um, I don't know. I thought that I would like to use it like also as kind of a blush highlight mix and not just highlight. And meanwhile, also maybe use it as an eyeshadow. Um, yeah. So the other ones were a bit too reddish and this one is kind of shimmery pink, peachy pink, so that's nice. Um, okay, so let's see if you can see that. Uh, let's do it like this. Um, yeah, wait a sec. Can you see that? right here it's like light pink shimmery you probably can't really see it in the camera but um, it's really nice I haven't actually tried it on myself yet because I just got home like a couple of hours ago well two hours ago um, so yeah you will probably be seeing this in tutorials soon so yeah, I'm so excited, my first mineralized skin finish. Um, yeah, okay, then I got a sample with that from this brand Canibo. I don't know if it's where the brand is from. Um, anyways, it's, uh, it's like a foundation, powder foundation sort of. And when I saw it, I was like, whoa, that is way too dark. But I tried it out and it's not that dark. Let's see. Looks like this. And I don't know if it even looks that dark in the camera. But I thought that I could use it like as a bronzer, but I tried it out and I can't even really see it on my skin. It's like the perfect skin tone for me. <laughs> yeah, okay, so um, then let's see. There's, oh yeah. Um, there's like this, uh, <sighs> this um, kind of deal that if you bought this from BB Young Hair, there's this uh, cream, well, face cream, um, yeah, and I bought the one for combination skin, and this one is originally seven bucks here, and it was marked down to five bucks, and you got a free um, pack of the regular um, um, makeup remover wipes with it. Uh, this one is for normal skin and I personally like the one for sensitive skin from BB on Care and I pretty much only use that one but I thought that I could try this out and well it was kind of free so why not. Um, yeah and oh something else I've been trying this um, I got this as a sample a couple of days ago uh, no last week and um, this is the Clinique Anti-Blemish Solutions Foundation and even in this very hot weather, we have like 30, 
three degrees here Celsius. Um, I'm I sweat like crazy. I don't even know why my body just reacts that way to the heat. And even in the heat, this doesn't like sweat off. And I don't know if it's with all Clinique foundations or just did this one. So if you have this foundation and or any other Clinique foundation for that matter, or if you have tried any Clinique foundations and you, um, I don't know, you can tell me something about it, that would be great. I really like the way this one applies and it gives a nice kind of medium coverage. Well, sort of full coverage, but not full coverage as um, like the, um, the MAC 3D Fix Fluid. This one is crazy full coverage and this is death to me in the summer. It's, I stay away from it as far as I can, so, yeah. Um, then, let's see. Oh, I got something else, which is a bit weird, but wait a second. Let me check the time. Time. I can't read that. Is it six minutes? Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's just that I'm filming with a regular camera so I can't see like myself when I'm filming so I always have to take my compact mirror and check um, if I'm in the frame and if I have time and yeah. Anyway, so um, I got this today because I'm going on like vacation next um, Friday, so in a week, and I need something to read. And it's weird enough that the Twilight series I started reading Eclipse and then Breaking Dawn and then Twilight, and now I'm reading new ones, so that's weird. But um, yeah, anyways, so I mean, I know what's gonna happen and stuff, but still I'm excited to read it because I liked reading the other ones so much. And I'm gonna go watch Eclipse on Tuesday and I'm so excited! Yeah. Ah. Um, yeah. Let's see. Um, what else? Oh, by the way, the song that you're hearing is Neutron's, Neutron Star Collision by Muse. Um, which is like the new uh, like Eclipse song, I guess, um, and I love it. It's been following me around in my head, and I just love it. Um, yeah, got a couple of other things, but not that interesting. Just like some Q-tips and stuff for vacation. And um, a a cleanser that I want to try out. Um, nothing special though. Yeah. Oh, and um, FYI, I am going next Friday and um, I'm going camping with my dad for two weeks in Denmark and then to our house in Sweden for, a, for one and a half week and then after one week his girlfriend and um, her like daughter and husband and or just her family they come they go there to come there and um, then I'm staying with like all of them for like three or four days and then so I am flying home from there so I need stuff that I can like squeeze in my um, what's it called my My suitcase, that's what it is. My suitcase. Anyways, so, um, yeah, I'm gonna get going. And, um, yeah, okay. So, talk to you soon. Bye.